Hello everyone and welcome back to another quick Blender tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add thickness to your mesh using the Solidify modifier. So let's get straight into it. So I've made this box and as you can see I haven't modelled this so well and so there's no thickness on my box. So to fix this I'm going to need to add a modifier. So I'll left click my cube then I'll click on this wrench icon called modifier properties, add modifier and then select Solidify. Now if I zoom in, you can notice that there is now a little bit of thickness around my cube. When I increase this value, you'll see it will get a little bit bigger. So I'm going to round it at about 0.06. That should do nicely. You'll notice that this offset value is at minus 1. Now what this offset controls is what direction the thickness is being added to. So if I change this value to 1, you'll see that the thickness is now being added to the outside. Whereas when I switch it back to minus 1 again, it's going into the inside. Also, if I go negative in my thickness value, it will it will go out the way as well. So that's another thing to keep in mind. I'll set my value back to 0 0.06. And another thing you'll notice, if you have a PBR texture on like I do, you'll see that the wood has gone quite strange here. So to fix that, I'm going to click this drop down on my Solidify add-on and just left click apply. And now when I press tab to enter edit mode, this is now part of the mesh. So I'll left click to or press Alt A to deselect everything and then I'm just going to press Alt left click here in face select mode which is just free on the keyboard to select this face loop. Then I'll just press U and I'll press Smart UV Unwrap. Then I'll press Tab to go back into object mode and it's not perfect but it is looking a little bit nicer now. I also made this lid here so I'm going to do the same thing here. I'll left click my lid, add modifier, solidify this time i'm going to make the offset positive so I'll change the value to one and i'll change my value to 0 0.06 again the texture is looking a little bit strange there so I'll just click the drop down and left click apply then i'll press tab to enter edit mode in face select mode of free on the keyboard i'll press alt a to deselect everything and then alt left click on this face loop here then i'll just press u smart uv project and then click OK then tab back into object mode and now my box has some thickness to it I'll bring this lid down and there we have it hope you guys found this tutorial useful if you did make sure to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when I make more videos like this in the future thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next video